Hey, an aide on your side alert now. If you're flying on United Airlines, you may have to leave your pet at home. The company is making some big changes after issues with dogs on its planes. News Channel 8's Amanda Shivari has the details. The change comes as a way to avoid cases like this. In March, a French bulldog puppy died after a flight attendant told the owner to put the dog in its carrier in the overhead compartment. Then just a few weeks later, United Airlines put a dog on the wrong plane. And instead of going to Kansas, this German shepherd ended up in Japan. I think it's terrible. I don't know. It's, uh, there's ways around it. And now there is. Pets will no longer be able to ride in the cargo area of the plane. I think that's a great idea. I do. It's, uh, I know Florida doesn't allow dogs in certain times of the year because of the heat. Those traveling with people in the airplane cabin will still be allowed, but animal advocates at Tampa Bay SPCA tell us before you travel, plan. Should I bring my pet with me? Is this the kind of pet that's going to do well in a, a bunch of unfamiliar environments because there's a lot of different things that happen between your house and your destination? If you think your pet can handle the stress of flying, prepare them for the trip. Are they, are they comfortable in their crate? Is it a crate that they know? If you're going to carry your pet on a plane in a crate, introduce them to that crate well in advance of that trip and make sure that positive things are happening in that crate. Treats, feeding, cuddling. As if we needed an excuse to cuddle our pets, right? Well, United is also making changes to what kinds of dogs and cats can go on a flight. Right now on WFLA.com, we do have a breakdown of United's changes, so go ahead and check that one out.